Welcome back to A.N. Northwest. You know our next guest for her best-selling historical novels. Now she's teamed up with her sister to create a children's book that shows kids the sky is the limit on their dreams. Here to share more, we welcome the women behind Ellie Mae Dreams Big, author Christina McMorris, and illustrator Amanda Yoshida. Good to have you both Hi, with us. Thank Good thank to see you, you again. Good to see you again. Okay, how did this come to be? Oh, let's see. Well, um, I decided that it'd be nice to write 300 words instead of 90,000. <laughs> so luckily, my sister, of course, has been an amazing illustrator, uh, full-time picture book illustrator, wow. award-winning, etc. So she asked me, would you like to team up? And so, yes, of course, I jumped at the chance. Oh, well, wow. also, I knew that she'd wanted to write a children's book for as long as I can oh, remember. Okay. So, so then how did, you, how did you come up with the whole, what's the theme behind Ellie Main Dreams Big? Yeah, well, the theme, just like the title suggests, it's about dreaming big, thinking outside the box, right. and then combining a lot of careers throughout the story that she does in a very whimsical way. But we love the fact that if you think about kids in the generation today are growing up in a time that they'll probably have careers that we haven't even thought, thought about. Right, today. we would wouldn't we have even exist. imagined, yeah, right? Which we love that. Yeah. So when you talk when you talk about um, dreams big, mm -hmm. how did you get ideas for some of the things? Are these things that your kids have gone through, like? Oh, yeah. I mean, we thought of all the things that, the most common things that kids get excited about. Right. And then we went through a whole bunch of different combinations to see what the most fun combinations of these careers would be. And for my, like, I have a son who's seven, and oh. he's so passionate about yeah. a number of careers, and I love that he does He's already care. passionate about oh, careers. Oh, yeah. That's and he great. refuses yeah. to choose one. He doesn't right. think he should have to, and I think yeah. that's great. And then one is one of one of the possibilities yeah. that you mentioned combining them astronaut yeah. chef yeah, <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. So how that came come to be? So we brainstormed that one together. So yeah, because Ellie Mae has to choose her career for school for a right, project. Right, right. She ha hates making decisions between the two, and so she remembers though that the moon is made of cheese. So <laughs> she's gonna take a slice out of it and make the best galactic grilled cheese sandwiches in the universe oh. for. And she created this a fly through instead of a drive through for the aliens to go through. Oh wow! So I she becomes an it. astronaut chef. Yeah. She becomes a ballerina painter. She thinks she's going to be a pirate dentist because. Yeah. They have the worst teeth ever, but they have lots of gold to fix all the cavities. <laughs> so it goes on oh from there. Oh my gosh, this is so great. When it comes to the illustrations, what did you try to keep in mind? What was important for you? Mm, one of the things that was really important to me was when I was little, I loved picture books. Yeah. They were what inspired me to start drawing in the first place. Yeah. But I never felt like I was being visually represented in them. Yeah. So, Explain that. Talk to me a little bit more about that. Oh, well, as as a minority, I yeah. just didn't feel like I was represented as someone who could be the hero. You didn't see yourself. You didn't no. see any Asian kids. Yeah. No, gotcha. I didn't. And um, and it's not just Asian. Right. You know, it's it's not the most important thing in the story, but I did want to represent just all the different... All different kids. Yeah. So that yeah. everyone can connect with one thing or another, right? Absolutely. Were there any challenges along the way? And you two are still, you're still here together, so everybody got along. Yeah, you notice yeah. that I'm, you notice <laughs> I'm leaning away, but... <laughs> no, I know. We always joke that you know you can't always travel with all your friends. Right. You, know, you realize at the end, like maybe we liked each yeah. other more before the trip. Yeah. Um, in this case, no, it worked out great. We had so much fun, and we really shocking me. I think we were both surprised how much we agreed uh, about almost everything. Right. So I'd give her suggestions for her artwork, which you know, of course, every little change takes her so many hours. Yeah. Where if she gave me tweaks for my narration, it, I got to. Just delete and change uh, the word. I'm like, sure. She's like, what else you got for me? Yeah. And done. <laughs> done. I'm like, this yeah. is not evil oh or gosh. fair. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> the book again is Ellie May Dreams Big. And if you'd like more information about the book events and appearances and all that, we're going to have it on our website at katu.com. Thank you both so much. Great Thanks. job. Thanks for having us. Thank you. you bet. All right, we'll be right back with more AM Northwest. Don't go away.